Hey guys, it's Lori. Let me just say right away in advance, thank you for spending time with me today because we're just going to go along my day and do a day in the life today. I'm on my way to my job right now and I actually have two jobs today, but they're right here local. So that's nice. I'm bringing along my little itty bitty Walmart bag. I love this little bag. It's so handy. I have another one too somewhere. I'm not sure where I put it, but I think I put tools in it to take with me somewhere once when I went to Courtney's actually. Anyway, yeah, I'm going to have to hunt for that one now. Now I'm curious. Where is it? I'll show you what's in my bag. I have my, um, this is just regular water. And I put it in this thinking maybe it would stay cold a little bit longer because it's supposed to be really nice today. So nice that I actually brought a pair of shorts too. Matter of fact, I'm just going to take those out of the bag. That way they don't get any, like when this sweats, I don't want to get moisture on it. But I have my Element Orange today. Yeah. I brought the orange salt flavor today and I'm really loving the element. It does me good and I'm really enjoying it. So at first I was like, that's really salty. I'm not sure if I'm gonna really like love this, but it it didn't take long and I'm like, yeah, I love this stuff. So I really do like it. Somebody that I work for actually gave me, I'm doing it right now. Somebody that I work for actually gave me um, some grapefruit ones just just a couple to try and I love the grapefruit they're really good so I will keep that in mind next time I need to get some because um I know there's lots of different flavors but for now I really like the the um I'm trying to think it's not lemon lime it's um citrus I think it's citrus yeah I'm pretty sure it's the citrus one I like the citrus and I like that one and I like the orange. I like the raspberry and watermelon, but honestly, I think I like the citrus one best. I'm not sure if I said that the last time. It's been a while since I told you my favorite. And I might've said it was the orange. I can't really remember, but I've gotten to where now I kind of like the citrus better. I might've said citrus last time too. I don't remember. But anyway, your favorites can change over time, I suppose, but it hasn't been that long. I do really like the grapefruit though so yeah and I have some chocolate ones too from Debbie she sent me some chocolate ones to try and Debbie I have not tried them yet I guess you would put those in your coffee right I think I'll have to try it I am so picky about my coffee that, yeah but I will I'll try that I'll try it see how I like it but my job's just right around the corner so I will get back with you in a bit job one's done it's 74 and sunny and I am burning up. <laughs> I didn't put my shorts on yet. I was gonna go back inside and put my shorts on, but I'm like, ah, I already mopped and it's all wet. I don't wanna walk over it because I'll have to do it over. So I'm just gonna put my shorts on when I get to my next job. Thought about going in the garage and just changing in the garage, but I'm like, what if they have camera in there? Because that's where their dog hangs out while they're gone. So, <laughs> you know, it's like, what if they have one of those, like, like a nanny cam type thing that you get for your dogs? It's like, no. I don't think I want to be the star of the show in there or anything, so. I am going to take the long way around because I need a break in between and I'm going to crank my air, so I'm not going to jabber. Oh, I could have put my windows up. I'm not going to jabber too long here because, like I said, I got to crank my air and I'm pretty sure it's probably going to interfere with the audio. I decided to park in the park. <laughs> I better put my windows up. It's probably interfering. There's a train, too. I don't know if you heard it or not, but I did. <laughs> yeah, I decided to park here in the park, the village park. I'm looking at the playground right now and the pond and stuff is behind me. I don't know whether you can see it because it's kind of across the way, but I'm giving myself a total of five minutes. Right now I have two more minutes left or no. Yeah, I have two minutes left. So <laughs> I can do math, I can count to five. I was driving here and I'm thinking, man, that just did not take long enough. I got to sit for just a few minutes and I don't like sitting in their driveway because I know the house I'm going to next has cameras outside and I'm thinking, I don't want them to see me like pull in and just sit there, you know? On the way here though, I saw some deer running and I thought, okay, I'm seriously just going to like hang my phone out the window. I hit record, hang my phone out the window, and just, if I get it, I get it, and if I don't, I don't. Well, I kind of did. 
I kind of got them in there. So part of it I didn't, but most of it I did. And then there was a couple stragglers too. So <laughs> I got those in there. And I know that because I sat here at the park and watched it back to see if I got it or not. But obviously can't use the audio. I was talking, but I don't know why, because it's just nothing but super loud wind. Because, I mean, I was literally hanging my phone out the window. Holding on to it for dear life, because I don't know what I would have done if I would have dropped my phone on the road. <laughs> uh, okay, so oh, I know my hair looks really frizzy today but oh, it's not that bad I guess that's kind of bad <laughs> it's kind of bad but that's okay okay I'm gonna head off to my job now my time is up right now so I'm off I'm at my second job now and I don't have it down yet 100% to know how long it takes me to do this job I'm still kind of I've only done this house a few times now so I'm still working on kind of each time I do it let me put it a different way Every time I do this job, I get done just a little bit quicker. So I think I have a routine down now. So we'll see how long it takes me. Last time I was here, it took me about an hour and a half. So about an hour and 35 minutes to be exact. So I'm going to time myself and see how long it takes me this time. I'll finish with this job and it took me about an hour and 30 minutes. So right about that hour and a half mark. So it did take me an hour and 30 minutes, just about on the dot. So that's pretty good, actually, for um, a two-bedroom. It's actually a three-bedroom, but it's just like a two-bedroom kitchen dining room. There's an extra room that's actually her office that's really, really easy to clean because it's basically just floors. She doesn't want me to do anything else. I dust around like her computer and that's it, like feather dust. And that's all I do in there besides floors. And there, oh, there's also like a little laundry area in there that I just kind of sweep it up. And then I, I run the mop over it too. But yeah, a two bedroom, but there is a third bedroom, like I said, and it's made into a toy room. And I have never seen a toy room that is so picked up and clean and organized like ever in my life but this one just so happens to be <laughs> and there's hardly ever anything out of place in there I mean nothing out of place in there <laughs> so not much to do in that room but yeah so I mean an hour and a half for everything kitchen takes the longest and then there's there's two bathrooms well one and a half bath so yeah that's about right hour and a half sounds pretty good okay I'm going to head home and I did get a text from Chase. He asked me if I could pick him up from work, but he got off work 10 minutes ago. So I'm sure he's already either walked home or gotten a ride from someone else. So the girl that usually takes him home, I think she's there today. I don't know. He didn't really say one way or the other, but she's been going out to the school and picking her son up before she brings him home. So <laughs> I don't know. He prefers to just come straight home instead, so, <laughs> which I understand, you know. So anyway, it's probably kind of... I don't know if it's awkward or not, but whatever. He doesn't care for that, so. Well, beggars can't be choosers, right? All right, I'm going to head on home, and I think I'm doing BLTs for dinner tonight. Well, I am doing BLTs for dinner tonight, but I'm not really sure. I, I need to make something else with it because I know Chase is not going to want that, and I'm not sure. Brendan probably will. I don't know. I'll see. He might do like a bacon and egg sandwich. So, okay. Thinking out loud, let me head home and let you know what I have going on for dinner. Before I get dinner started, I'm just going to chill for a few minutes. I'm going to sit outside and have a cup of coffee with Josh. He's sitting outside right now and John's not going to be home for about three and a half hours. So yeah. And we got this guy up here too. So I gotta sick him out of the window and clean up the counter because I don't like cats on my countertop. I've given up on trying to keep him out of the window. It's just not gonna happen. But as long as he's not like hanging out on the actual countertop, I don't really care because he he does just like jump up there and straight into the window. So I've made sure there's nothing on my windowsill because <laughs> if you can see over here on this side, I use my windowsill like a shelf. I mean, what's even up there? Now, this little, this dish soap thing has just a little bit in the bottom, so I'm frugal. What can I say? All right, my coffee's ready. I'm going to go have a cup of coffee out on the front porch while this weather's nice. It is 75 degrees outside right now. Loving it. 
Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. <laughs> I sat outside for over an hour. It was so nice out there. <laughs> sat outside for over an hour and I told Josh, I said, I better go inside and get dinner started before everybody starts ordering DoorDash. <laughs> so you didn't order DoorDash, did you, Chase? No. Okay. Well, I'm making um, BLTs. Does that sound good? <laughs> That's not his favorite thing. You can do, um, if you'd rather, I can make you an egg sandwich with egg and bacon and cheese. Does that sound good? All right, I'll make up some fried eggs like I did the other day so you guys can have them whenever you want them. And here I am getting the tomato sliced up and I'm gonna get some lettuce ready. I already have bacon in the oven. I got two pans in there right now and there's still a partial package. When those come out, I'll get those in. I'll get the rest of this in, I mean. And this is my, I had this little bit of bacon grease in the fridge, so I microwaved it a little bit because it was so cold. I didn't want to put like fresh out of the oven bacon grease, sizzling bacon grease into a cold jar. So there's that. I'm all set up and ready here. And these are my, these are my, they're bowl covers, but I'm just going to cover up the lettuce and tomato with them. So, all right, let me get this going. This tomato is kind of, kind of hard. I know you can't really see what I'm doing because, well, you kind of can, I guess. <laughs> but I mean, I'm slicing a tomato. These guys, we just all eat whenever we're hungry. So I try to make things and just kind of have it ready for them to heat up or whatever they want to do. For the eggs, I can just put them, I'll show you when I do the eggs because I can fry up a bunch of eggs and they will not go to waste. That's for sure. Everybody here likes an egg sandwich, so it's kind of thick. Tomatoes are ready to go and I'm just gonna get some of the lettuce ready on a plate so it's ready to go. This is kind of floppy on the outside, but. Chase, you gonna have lettuce on yours? Huh? You gonna have lettuce on yours? I already knew the answer to that. Chase doesn't do lettuce. I don't think you really do anything green, do you? Green beans. Yeah. What kind of vegetables do you like, Chase? Green beans and corn. I know that. Carrots. Yeah, you like the carrots from a roast. Then I just put whatever's left of this right back into the plastic it was wrapped in and throw it in the fridge just like that. So I'm going to go ahead and cover these because I just happened to think you guys might be thinking those are kind of weird looking bowl covers, but <laughs> that is what they are. You just do this. They are like the shower cap, shower cap looking bowl covers. So I got these from Timu and that's that's the only time I've ever ordered from Tino, but I don't know. They do have some pretty cheap stuff, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know about that place. All right, so here's the lettuce and tomato. All right, I got all my eggs cooking over here and the bacon's done in the oven and I'm like, oh no, my toast is popping up. My eggs are getting ready to, go, getting ready to burn. The bacon's done. I didn't time it very good. But that's okay. That is, that is okay. What's he barking at? Hmm? Okay. And I gotta get my bacon grease poured off into this jar because I gotta have my bacon grease. That's actually what I'm cooking the eggs in right now. Frying the eggs in bacon grease. When my oven wasn't working, I was like, oh gosh, I can't believe it. I'm like out of bacon grease. I need to make bacon. And I really hate making bacon on the stovetop. I just can't stand doing it on the stovetop anymore. I love it in the oven. It's so easy and yeah, good. This toast buttered. I got a whole plate full of toast. Can you see it? I got a whole plate full of toast over here, buttered. It's just lightly buttered. Most of it's lightly toasted and lightly buttered. And this is going to be for the guys. I'm not sure if I'll have 
a BLT or if I'll have a salad. I'm not sure yet. I'm gonna get the rest of this bacon in the oven, get it going, and I'll show you how I'm doing my fried eggs real quick too. I always use two pans. One of them is just, I turn it on enough, long enough to warm it, and then I shut it back off, and that's where I keep the eggs that are done. And that might seem silly, but that way the guys can just eat whenever they get hungry, and we don't have to worry about me. I don't have to worry about getting up and fixing them an egg sandwich when they get hungry. You know what I'm saying? And could they fix their own egg sandwich? Yes, they could. But I want to get all this cooked and get the kitchen done and cleaned up and just, just be able to sit down and relax. So, you know, and I like cooking for them. So, and they kind of expect it. So. <laughs> You know, and it's not like they're sitting there demanding their dinner. Where's my dinner? <laughs> a lot of times Brendan will text me from school or he's doing an internship now and he'll text me from that sometimes. And he'll just say, are you cooking anything tonight? <laughs> and sometimes I say, no, there's leftovers. So the next thing you know, here comes DoorDash. <laughs> it's like, why don't you just pick it up on your way home? <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't know, guys. This DoorDash thing is just... It's crazy. It's crazy to me. John and I have done DoorDash a couple of times, but it's kind of expensive. I'd rather just go pick it up myself, but you know what though? It's convenient and it's really nice. Like John has done it a couple times in the past and ordered like breakfast and he'll just order like a whole bunch of different random stuff. And then he'll say, hey, I DoorDash some breakfast and everybody gets to pick what they want. <laughs> so that's kind of fun, but anyway. Let me get this done. Here's the pan that I'm cooking the eggs in. I just shut it off because they're done. But this pan over here is keeping them warm. And I have, there's one underneath there too that doesn't have any cheese. There's two of them with no cheese, two of them with cheese, and here's two more with cheese. And this will be for the guys. And Chase doesn't like cheese on his, so. And Hayden is the one that asked for the BLTs. And I would bet you anything that he'll have an egg sandwich and a BLT. You know, growing boys. They're starting to come out for dinner. They're smelling the food over here. Hayden's making his BLT. Are you gonna put egg on it? No. No? Are you gonna have an egg sandwich too? Yeah, <laughs> that's what I thought. Growing boy. The second pan of bacon is in the oven right now. So I can't put this away just yet, but I got my one pan washed. The other one, the other one won't be a problem to wash at all because it's really just keeping all the eggs warm. Um, yeah, so as soon as that bacon comes out, my plan was to get, hop in and get a quick shower because <laughs> I definitely need a shower. Then I'm gonna go sit down and edit and actually get a video up. And I wanna try and start getting videos out on a more regular basis. So. The reason I haven't been lately is because I was watching the trial. I had two different trials I was watching. Well, they're both over now. Guilty across the board for both. April 1st starts another big one that I'm going to be watching for sure. But I do want to try and start getting videos out on a more regular basis. I was kind of doing them daily. And I actually like doing just vlogs. Just a vlog, taking you through my day with me. Do you guys like that kind of video? I don't know. It just, it, it's, it's just something that I like to do. I, I don't want to be boring, you know? <laughs> Sometimes I think, well, who cares about this? Or who cares about that? But anyway, I like hanging out with you guys. So I always appreciate you hanging out with me and spending the day with me. Um, yeah. Now I'm just like twiddling my thumbs until this bacon is done. How much time is left on the timer? You have three minutes and 10 seconds left on the 15 minute timer. Okay, three minutes left. I'm gonna check it real quick. I don't know whether you can see it or not, but yeah. I'm not sure if three minutes is gonna do it or not, so. By the time it's done, I think Chase will probably be out of the bathroom because I don't know if you could hear it or not. It might've been interfering with the audio, but he was drying his hair, so. Yeah, and he is super excited about our hairstylist coming back too because he goes to her and he really likes her and he hasn't had his hair cut in a really long time. 
I would have him show it to you, but he won't. He does not like it. I think it looks good long, but he doesn't like it long, so. I had to pause a sec. I didn't want him to hear, him talk, hear me talking about him, but I think he heard me anyway. <laughs> so, anyway, he's been wearing a hat, like a stocking cap, and he's like, Mom, it's going to start getting nice out now. I can't be wearing a hat around. When's she coming back? <laughs> I'm not sure. I got to mess message her and find out. Here's what I decided to have tonight. I'm gonna have a salad with, I think I've got three pieces of bacon on there and a little tomato, a little cheese. We've got some coleslaw mix in there and some romaine. And I'm not trying to fool anybody by not having my dressing on. I just haven't put it on yet because I thought it looked pretty just like that. <laughs> but I am gonna be using the Betty's French dressing. So just regular old French. It's not sugar-free or anything. It's just French. And this is how much bacon grease I ended up with. So, not too bad. I also decided to have the last of the deviled eggs. So I'm gonna have four deviled eggs. So actually that's like two eggs, right? And I did throw on some extra lettuce because I got too much dressing. So I'm like, uh, yeah, too much dressing. I threw on some more lettuce. I really don't like a lot of dressing. So, okay, this is dinner. Okay, the shower's done, dinner's done, everything's done. Even got to sit outside for a while. That was kind of nice, wasn't it, Josh? Yep. <laughs> yeah. So, anyway, video's uploading, so who knows how long that's going to take. But it's going to be up later than usual. I usually like to have them, up, have them up around 7. That's not happening today. But everything is done, and I'm showered. So I'm ready for John to come home and have coffee with him. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next one.